What up, what it do, cyber world? It is your girl, the one and only Ash Said It. Ash Said It.com, Ash Said It.com. This is the Ash Said It daily podcast show. Yes, my darlings, yes. 1,100 plus episodes, yes. Half a million streams worldwide, yes. And I wanted to, you know, we, we kind of talk a little bit about everything on this show. You know, you just never know what Ash is going to delve into. But today, I want to jump into something because, for whatever reason, people still underestimate me. And it just marvels my mind. It absolutely, like, I just, I just smile to myself and I just cheese from ear to ear because these people have tried it yet again. Now, me personally, who I am today, I could have never in a million years thought that I would be. Never. It never even occurred to me. And one thing with me that still irritates the crap out of people is that when I have my mind fixated on something, I can't speak for nobody else, but for me personally, when I have my not, my mind fixated on a goal, something that I'm going to do, I go out there, I get it done point blank period now it may not be executed the way that it happened in my mind (laughs) and there may have to be some readjustments along the way but I'm gonna get it done nonetheless it will get done it is going to be completed darlings yes just not necessarily in the way that I thought that it would be and my resilience it amazes me because I didn't Honestly and truthfully, I never really thought about myself as being a resilient person because I always had my mom when she was here on earth. I always had my mom because she would always pump me up. She would always have me motivated. She believed in me way more than I believed in myself. And honestly and truthfully, it took her passing for me to start to believe in my own talent and my own gifts and what I'm able to do. And it's been phenomenal the stuff that I've been doing and the stuff that I have done it's just like whoa wait what what now what you doing Ash you doing this and I am I'm really doing these things and I'm just so thankful because I know that it didn't have to happen this way I know that the blessings that have been opened up for me are blessings that did not have to see the light of day I know this there's no question about it absolutely no question about it I know for a fact that these things that have happened for me and to me have happened for a reason and I'm just thankful I'm so thankful because I know that there are so many different ways that things could have gone and there's so many different angles of life that could have happened for me and to me and I'm just grateful that I'm in a place that. I can excel in. I have people around me that love me for me, not but not not for what they can get out of me and not for what they can get me to do for free because those days are long gone. People that aren't around me just to try to step on me and try to poison my dream, people that are around me that are threatened by me for whatever reason and it's crazy because I do not feel as though I'm in competition with any person. If I'm in competition with anyone, It's with Ash from the day before. I'm in competition with myself of making myself the best version of me that I can be. And the fact that there are people that will pretend to to be on your side or pretend to be in your circle or your realm or whatever. And their whole goal is to try to deter you from your dream and your vision and what you're supposed to be doing. It's crazy as hell to me. And it's quite sad because, wow, like, rather than you figuring out what your dream and what your goal and what your, you know, what your stuff is going to be, you would much rather sit up and pretend to be someone's friend and sabotage what they've got going on. It's crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy, but guess what, people? It happens. It happens, it happens, and it happens. And I just want to say that if you've got some of those negative, those crazy people around you, 
do your best use all of your will and your God to get away from those people because they will poison your dream they will steal your dream they will just completely set your world upside down inside out for no reason other than them not having a purpose within their own life so I'll tell you today anyone to tell you any one person to tell you oh you can't do that that's impossible ain't nobody never did that in life maybe you're the one that's supposed to do it maybe you're that spark that the universe has been waiting for don't waste it on these people and don't let these people make you waste your dream don't do it all right so they want to tell you that you can't do what you want to do you look them square in the face tell them don't believe me just watch watch what i do watch me make it happen watch me make history that's what we're doing this for we're doing this for the history books social media is nice but real life is so much better it's so much better all right take a break take some time for yourself take a breather and enjoy this life i'm gonna holla at y'all later deuces